up guys? Episode 9 All About Swimming. Welcome back. Thank you guys for subscribing. We got up to 800 subscribers, which is pretty epic. I mean, the goal is a thousand, but uh, we're going to get there soon because you guys are killing it, you know? <laughs> this week, I am actually swimming at the Cornwall Trials here in Durban. And although I'm super excited to race, you know, because I, I love what I do, you know, swimming, all about swimming. Yeah. But I'm actually super keen to just go home, back to Cape Town, see the family, see the friends. Just get that sound for you, of course, Christmas is around, come on. Yeah. So I thought, why not show you guys what I pack in my swimming bag? For all you swimmers out there, I think maybe it'd be quite interesting to see what I pack when I'm competing. And for you non-swimmers out there, yeah, I'll just keep watching. So guys, enough of me talking, enough of me talking, I do too much of that stuff sometimes. Let's see what I pack in my swimming bag. So as you can imagine, when packing a swimming bag, all you need is a bag. This is the most important, but I'm going to show you what we put in the bag here. We're going to start off with some bare essentials. You cannot swim without a pair of goggles. I'm going to go with the Lean Green Party Rocking Trash Machines over here. Now these are pretty cool. Guess what these do? They keep the water out your eyes. And of course, a cap. you got to keep the main in the cap. You don't want to get that chlorine damage, you know what I'm saying? Now, this is the one that everyone forgets. So we packed our cap and goggles, but guess what? Your goggles might break, your cap might tear, you might lose your cap, you might lose your goggles. I'm just gonna give you guys a little hint. No one likes lending their stuff out to anyone. I mean, you might say, yeah, sure, use it, use it. But we're hitting you, we're hitting you, bro. We're not taking it, dude. We think you're gonna break our cap and goggles, and we're not happy, and that's the only pair we have. Bring a spare. We got spare goggles, we got spare cap. Be cool, bro. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I don't race in the nude. I mean, I could if I would, but. <laughs> illegal so you gotta have a racing suit we gotta go with a racing suit now guys always bring more than one racing suit don't just come with one because you know what I mean? I've seen many people actually put on racing suits and it tears you have more more than one race bring another one make sure you have a spare so I've always got my spare and I'm never gonna lend you a costume because I'm not like that I'm not cool like that so I don't know if any of you guys know the main oaks at the gym they like to wear their vests you know three sizes too small to make the muscle look huge boy well us swimmers, we like to do the same thing with our suits, actually. These suits that I just showed you, we actually like to wear them quite small, quite tight, to keep it very, very streamlined, you know, in the water. We swim super fast, you know? But, unless you like boa constrictors around your gonads, you can't sit on those all day. You can't walk on those costumes as well. So, we like to bring a training brief. This is what we warm up before. This is what, you know, we get in the other pool. We have a little warm up for our session. And, we're feeling fancy free. Swimmers, we also do have quite a lot of equipment that we use when we're training. But, obviously, when we go to a competition, we don't want to take too much. But what I like to take, I like to take a board. A little kickboard. My name on A little bit of swing swing as well. <laughs> so, we can just have a little bit of a flutter kick, you know, just, just warm up the leg. Big one for me is because I'm a little bit lazy. I like to wear some fins, you know, we get a little extra propulsion, it's all good, you know, so that's what I like to warm up with. Being a swimmer, being in the water all the time, things will be getting wet, so bring yourself a top to dry off afterwards. So, with global warming and all, we never know what the temperature's gonna be like. The weather is annoying. So if you're wearing shorts, going to the gala, bring yourself some long pants, because, you know, it could get cold. And vice versa, if you're wearing long pants, wear some shorts. And of course, we don't just stick to the bottom of the body, bring a jersey, bro. It could get cold. So we're gonna go to the edibles now. I don't like to eat super amounts of foods when I'm at the gala, you know, I don't wanna feel full, you know, you know that whole thing, you know, you eat before you sort of get sink and drown. So I don't wanna I don't wanna have that. So I like to have an energy bar, pretty cool, tastes good, I'm happy with them, but uh, just a message, PBM, can't find you anywhere. Can you guys stock up in some more stores? It'd be great. And a good old banana, dude. Get that potassium in. Yeah, just a little tip. When I was a younger swimmer, I, I got caught up in rituals, you know, I was like all about having a half banana before I raced, a bite of an energy bar and like a few sips of my juice and that was it. Then I went to my first competition overseas and guess what? There were no bananas. Major freak out. I didn't know what to do. I was in a bit of a state, neurotic, nervous wreck, not good. So what I told myself after that day, never get caught up in too many race rituals. Obviously you can have certain things, but stick to things that you can control. When it comes to food, like energy bars and stuff like that, like I said with these PVM dudes, I can't find them all the time. So I'm not reliant on the PVM bars or the banana, I'm reliant on myself. I'm not too concerned with external factors. Fun fact for you, Brian Sweeney. TM. Another classic, gotta stay hydrated as well. Keep the electrolytes up. So I always have my juice. There's no juice in here right now because I'm filming. I don't want to waste that juice. And of course, recovery is key. So get the protein. Get the protein shake. Also, 
nothing inside as you can see, but it's because I'm full. Now we're talking therapances to warm my shoulders. We do all sorts of exercises that make us look pretty crazy, but it's okay. But we need this for shoulder prevention and all sorts of other things. That is pretty cool to have. That I do not like to go to competition without is my Hyper Arch for Radiant Promo. <laughs> I absolutely love this promo. This this is perfect. It's perfect for warming up, perfect for recovery. Sometimes when you don't actually have a pool to warm up in at a competition, this roller is great to warm up before. It shakes and vibrates the muscles and we just have a good old time. So you're probably wondering why it's so zoomed up in my face right now. It's because my next one's actually about having a hat. I mean, I got pretty crazy hair, so sometimes I need to tame the mane, you know? I can't be walking around like a savage. I have to have a cap. Yeah, all about swimming caps coming soon, but yeah. Sometimes it's not even that hot outside, the sun's not out, you know, you're actually indoors, but just uh, it's always sunny and doucheful, baby. <laughs> yeah, I'm bringing sunnies for the honeys. Yeah, yeah, it's on the back, baby. Although I just showed you all the things that I pack in the bag, we gotta show you how to pack the bag. Are you ready? <laughs> Three, two, one, yeah. Nice, nobody touched me in a righteous. Nobody text me in a crisis. I believe all in your dreams are duration. You took my heart, I'm a kid, I'm a patient. You took my heart, I'm a sleep at decoration. We stick in my love, I brought for you for foundation. All that I wanted from you was to give me something that I never had. Something that you never seen. Something that you never been. Wake up and nothing nothing's wrong. Just get ready for work. watching this video me packing my swimming bag who knew packing a bag would be so sick that's what we talk about all about swimming toys left dude yeah <laughs> guys thank you so much for watching now remember i say this all the time but uh, some of you are missing so i have to kind of say it over and over again but like subscribe and share this video that'll be pretty epic i'll be pretty happy to i'll give you a thumbs up like like this gonna have a little bit of delay in the video next week i'm swimming trials so wish me luck i want to wish everyone good luck swimming at commonwealth trials and obviously all my friends around the world good luck in all your competitions as well hope you guys are watching have a swing, swing, yeah, yeah. Rolling, rolling, rolling. How many more shots until you're rolling? We just need face to face. You could pick the time and the place. You'll spend some time away. Now you need to forward.